We heard about this CDC study and how the average Americans is 15 uh, average American. I'm having a quite a Monday today. If you're listening for the first time all summer, give me a break and I'll be better tomorrow. <laughs> the average American is 15 pounds heavier than 20 years ago. Now we're going to let medical specialist Dr. John Michaels do all the talking. Good morning, doctor. How are you? Hey, John. hey doc. Good morning. Doing well. Thanks for having me. All right. Give us the skinny on this study. Why are Americans fatter than they were just two decades ago? Well, it's multiple components. One, we are eating a higher amount of carbohydrates, a higher amount of sugars than we were, and we are far less active than we were 20 years ago. We are sitting in front of our iPods and our iPads and our phones and our computers and our television screens. So the combination of increased carbohydrates and caloric intake and less activity is why we are heavier as a society. Now, haven't we always had rolls with dinner and eaten sandwiches and had our share of potatoes? How are we having more carbs? Well, you know, interesting enough is we are eating far more processed foods. And part of gotcha. this is the, uh, the medical community in the United States, we were promoting a, a high-carbohydrate, low-fat diet for years. Now that we've looked back on the trends in health in the United States, we've seen that obesity has increased since we were promoting those diets. And so we've recognized we need to take that food pyramid and turn it upside down. All right. Dr. John Michaels joining us on uh, Memphis Morning News. And, and you talked about technology. Even just it, it, there are so many basic things that can now be handled by computer. We lose probably a couple of thousand steps a day uh, on stuff that we used to have to do. Even even getting up and I, I know a lot of people are probably a little too old. Maybe maybe we're too young, but getting up and changing the channel. But just <laughs> even just simple stuff that would take, you know, 20, 30, 40, 50 steps. Now a computer takes care of. And, and now we've become almost a, a victim of our own technology. We have. We are far too sedentary as a society because technology has enabled us to do so. Even things like going to the store and having to buy clothes, we can now do online. You click on Amazon and you can have anything delivered to your house within a day or two. So our activity levels have significantly declined as a society and it's having hazardous consequences on our health. All right, so we need just to take a few extra steps, maybe get foods that only have one ingredient like a vegetable, a fruit, or a meat, and uh, probably drink more water in that mix as well. Absolutely, I say look at the ingredients on the back of the packages of what you're consuming. If you can't pronounce it, you shouldn't eat it. Because if you don't recognize what it is, guess what? Your body doesn't either, and it doesn't know what to do with it. Medical specialist Dr. John Michaels, thank you for joining us on Memphis Morning News. Thanks for sharing your thoughts on the CDC report. Have a great day. Thank you. You too. We could talk to him a lot longer. I'm going to circle his name. He's in a tight schedule today.